Our own Mike Jacobs talked to a true American hero who served in the Vietnam War. He made an unforgettable sacrifice for our country, and we take a look back now in the Mike Jacobs story, the career to remember. Career to remember. Every night before I go to bed or get ready for bed, I you know, take the war off. Gary Wetzel is reminded of the Vietnam War every day. And in the morning when I'm getting ready for the day, I put the war back on. Wetzel was a gunner on an assault helicopter, just 20 years old with a Thompson machine gun, a kid from South Milwaukee who became a man overnight. Shot down five times, number five nearly killed him. That led to the Congressional Medal of Honor. He'll never forget how he earned it. Bullets are flying and things are being blown up and yelling and screaming. This is all that's left of his chopper. It was hit by rocket-propelled grenades. Everyone on board was killed or wounded. I just did a lot of yelling, and I'm looking, and here my arm is hanging straight down. Wetzel's left arm was shredded. The Viet Cong were killing the survivors. So more or less I skidded on my belly and elbow, got around the ship, and there were six of them. And they're, you know, jabbering, jabbering, whatever, and I yelled at them, and they turned, and of course, and I pulled the trigger. Wetzel started dragging his Some wounded buddies to safety, one. but he had to get back to his ship and his 60 caliber machine gun. Kind of took my hand here and that, and tucked it inside my waist waistband so it wouldn't flop around. And I got my Thompson, and I tell people, I did what they call the uh, my, my John Wayne run, get back to my ship because that's where the 60 is. He wiped out waves of attacking Viet Cong. I got my 60 and I'm like, come on you bastards, come on. And uh, they came, but they didn't get any farther than, you know, you and me away. And I did that a couple times. Barely alive, Wetzel spent the night rescuing wounded colleagues. Medevaced out the next day, he spent months in the hospital. To his amazement, and Wetzel and four heroes from other battles were summoned to the White House. Above and beyond the call of duty. President Lyndon Johnson placed the Congressional Medal of Honor around his neck. I'm standing there looking at the the president, and I'm, I'm in just in awe. The Medal of Honor citation reads, Specialist Fourth Class Gary Wetzel displayed extraordinary heroism. So does he feel like a hero? It's uh, I'm just a soldier, you know, trying to do a job. And I tell folks that when I do have that privilege to wear that blue ribbon, it's, it's a piece of all of us. So just, uh, just one of the lucky ones, I guess. At our request, Wetzel's wife, Kathy, placed the medal around his neck. What does it mean to you today to wear that medal? It's a um, honor. It's a privilege. Every time, it's a great honor. Specialist fourth class Gary Wetzel, a true American hero. Mike Jacobs, today's TMJ4. And we have the incredible story behind this story coming up tonight on Live at 10.